Today I show you how to separate the notifications and the quick settings panel in your Samsung Galaxy Android phone. This is Samsung Galaxy S23 Ultra with One UI 7, Android 15 and now the settings I put them to be merged the same way as they were before on One UI 6.1 but if you want to use the new style of notifications, if you want to have more space for notifications and the control center now I have them together, I have to swipe down twice to see the full quick settings panel but if you have them separate you wouldn't need to do that so if this is what you want, if you want to see the new style of notifications and quick settings you open the quick settings and open it again, swipe down again from the quick settings to see the pencil icon you need to see the pencil icon to go to the quick settings panel options. To go to the panel settings, you have to press on the pencil icon and uh, not the gear one. Maybe there is a way to do it from the gear icon from the settings, but it's much easier to do it from the panel settings directly. So you swipe down two times and you see that pencil icon on the right side of the phone or in that area. Now, this will make it so you only open the quick settings when you swipe down from the top right and not from the center or top left. And if this is what you want, this is how you change it. It's pretty easy. You have to open the panel settings. So that's the pencil icon there. And then go to panel settings. And here you have the option set to together. The panels are set to be together, but you can set them separate. For together you have options to customize the top row for the first swipe down and the second one. You also have settings for the media control options and the brightness control if you want to make more space, if that's what you want and you might want to keep them together. You can customize it like this, but in when you have these set to separate, you can also set the quick panel to show on the left side if you wanted to, but I prefer it on the right side. You save by pressing done. So once you press done, the settings are saved. And now the anywhere from the left to the middle or even close to the right, it will open the notifications, not the quick settings. Here I show you, I can swipe from the center of the screen even and it will show notifications. So the priority here changes from quick settings to notifications. And when you want to see the quick settings, if you want to make sure you don't accidentally open the quick settings panel, this is a really great way to do that. When you open the quick settings, you can also switch between notifications and quick settings by swiping left and right. So the same way you swipe left and right when you have the panels with apps, you can do the same things with the notifications and the quick settings panel. This will make more space for more notifications and also more quick settings. You can have more items, more, more things on the screen. And you can always put it back to together if that's what you want. It's very easy to switch between the modes. So now they are set to together. I go to the panel settings, I set them back to separate and pressing down, really it's simple, very easy to change, to switch between them. It's the new way to see the notifications and the quick settings. And if you want to use this new way, you might get used to it. And it's actually more useful to have more space for uh, the items on the screen. You could even have bigger controls, bigger items on the quick settings. I hope this video helps you set your Samsung Galaxy phone to the new notification style. Thanks for watching.